Hey guys, and welcome back to Terror from the Deep. When we last left off, we were tracking a small UFO, and that's okay. Because we finally have mind control. So, let's have a little... Oh. And throw it. Does it have to be used in two hands? Ah. How does this work? Let's get some guys out here. Right, you can now see him. H. And, of course, our mind control... Yeah, Angel, who is really freaking powerful with that. Can't. I think it takes 30. Thirty time units. Throw? Why is it just saying throw? I'm confused. Hmm. I'm very confused. That is the disruptor. So how? How do we use that? Throw. Out of range. So that literally is going to be him throwing it. Uh, well... I think we're going to have to nuke this Tazuth. Because otherwise... We're going to have problems. And there's another one there. Because of course there is. You can also fire a shot. Launch torpedo. Maybe I need to read up on how this works. Because I'm really not sure. I thought... Ooh. Don't know how that Tazuth survived. I really don't know how that Tazuth survived. Okay. Oh, good. Um. Yep. Yeah. Well. You're in a bit of issues. Uh, you're you're in a bit of a tight spot there, buddy. Um, throw. Why can't? You can see him, surely. sit there. You can actually like kneel down. You... Do you have a medkit? You do. 
you can go heal him. You actually can heal one of his uh, wounds as well. Cool. Heal. Nice. Alright, okay. I'm definitely confused at this whole mind control thing. You used to... Have I turned mind control off? Molecular control? Hmm. Is that why we haven't seen it yet? Alien breeding. Oh, bleeding. Uh. Mm -hmm. I wonder if I've turned it off. I don't know why I would have turned it off, because I actually like the uh, molecular control stuff. Um. Death notifications. Yes, please. Huh. Okay. Um, okay. Yeah, maybe I need to look at the options. Maybe I've I've turned MC off. That's really weird. Uh, I definitely don't remember turning MC off because I quite like MC. I know I changed it so you had to have line of sight so you couldn't just cheese it. Uh, but mm, I don't know. Maybe I clicked the wrong button, I guess. All right, let's get everyone out anyway. Oh yeah, everyone's got the magnetic iron armor now, haven't they? Yes. Yes. Right, okay. That's really bloody annoying. Did I turn that off by accident? Oh, oh. I wondered, you know, why we weren't getting um, anybody, like, mind controlling us. Or molecular control, I should say. I did think that was strange. But then I just thought maybe we got lucky. I would be quite annoyed to find out that we haven't actually had it on at all. Oh, oh yeah, you need to heal. Uh, also, you can get your gun back out. There we go. Take to the skies. Aim shot. You can't do any. You can't do any kind of shots. What am I talking about? Um. Can you? Fifty-two percent for thirty. You're in a really horrible spot. You are. Ah, uh, don't say we got to nuke this guy. That would be like a huge waste. Can we hit you with that maybe? 40%. What does that require? 30? No, you can't. I've got no time units left. Ugh. I think he might actually be the last one left. And on that note, it would be nice to get a rookie to get the kill. But. That's probably not going to happen. Yeah. Um, 30... Right, so you could go for a... God, I hate this map. Oh my god, I hate this map. Um... Map is horrible. Right. 
He's gonna be a sneaky, sneaky little fucker and hide. I really don't want to use a uh, pulse round on this guy. Um, see where he goes. Yeah, you can shoot the tank. That's fine. Because you ain't really going to do any damage to the tank. Let's be fair. Oh, there's another one. There's two. Okay. Right, can you guys actually... Alright, go for an aim shot. Yeah. <laughs> oh god, the fun and games of rookies. Oh, rookies. Can I actually take two aim uh, snapshots? Oh, maybe you can't. You. Snapshot. Oh, you're... Accuracy is pretty good actually. 73%. I mean, it's XCOM 73%, so it's still not decent. Right, Angel was a proper rookie, so she can set out over here. Okay, hopefully. 29. No, can't do nothing. You, 69%. Can you? Nope. Nope. You, 75% chance? Yes. Okay, well, I mean, I'll, I'll take that, I guess. Ow. Oof, you hit the rookie. We don't like it when you hit the rookie. Where's our detection barge? Where are you? There you are. I was gonna say, you can't hide. It's not allowed. Uh, well, I guess we we knew the tank wasn't going to hit anything because the tanks can't hit anything. Uh, think of the experience. Every shot fired and missed is experience. But at the same time, guys, we, we do need to, you know, hit and kill this alien. Okay. Yeah, I know. Scary, weird concept, but that's what we're here for. There we go. And we basically got nothing from that. But some of the rookies got some experience, and that's what we need. We need rookies with experience. I don't think they get anything at all if they don't actually... Um... Yeah, we use two disruptor arms. Now we've got promotions. Yeah, I don't think they get any experience at all if they don't do anything. They actually have to do stuff, which makes sense. Lobster man technician, hunter. This vessel is equipped with an exper uh, experimentation room for performing experiments in surgery on human subjects. The victims are subjected to the foulest tortures and the brain is often removed and stored for processing en route. Eesh. Yeah. That's really rough, I'm not gonna lie. Really rough. Hmm. Where's that? Yeah. Fingers crossed we can splash this one. We need to take this down. We do. We have to. Come on. Oh dear. Okay. 
there's not a lot we can do. There's not a lot we can do. Shit, he's off. Um, yep. Yep, not gonna happen. Return to base, both of you. Return to base. Yeah, there's nothing we could do there. Lobster Man Technician, Dreadnought. That's what we were just hunting. Super Troop Carrier, fully equipped with all alien technologies and a vast payload. The Dreadnought is a tough and formidable opponent. Yeah. It is. And we... Oh, yeah, that's what I was going to do. Uh, if I save the game... Uh, do two mid. And if we go to options, game options. Um, okay. Right. Uh, abandon game. So, uh, mods. Um, allows unlimited wave. Aliens will be limited by difficulty. Okay. Uh, psionic line of fire. Yeah, we've got that enabled. Uh, always night time. No, no psionics. No, so we can use psionics. So, why? Why can't we use? Um, how strange, aquanauts, MC training. Uh, right, so we want to get Angel on board. Oh, he's like 97. Angel is 96, so let's take... Let's take, like, you off. And let's put you on. Uh, H is pretty good. You're useless. You can go in. So who else you're in? Okay, so all of our side guys are now in the training. Yeah, not sure what's going on with the psionics then. That's really weird. And I'm not a fan of that escort. A medium sized escort. That's not medium. A vessel that is of little threat on its own. This craft precedes the arrival of larger vessels and increased activities. Lobster Man Squad Leader. We're really getting to work on this. Oh, sub pen at Gamma is complete. Nice. So we need. And the transmission resolver is almost done. So we want a, well, yeah, we're waiting till next month to get the Barracuda. So we don't have to pay this month's fee. Cool. That's good. So that means these buildings is going to start going now. Um, you know what? I could get another sub pen, but I don't think we're going to need one. Actually, yeah, we're not going to need one. Lobster Man Squad Leader. <clears throat> alien infiltration. This can result in official contact between aliens and corporations or governments at the highest level. The climax of this activity is characterized by intense alien sub-activity in the waters of the organization concerned. 
<clears throat> the aliens will attempt to sign an agreement with a government or organization by offering knowledge of their superior technologies. This alien activity represents a major threat to XCOM. If a corporation or government cooperates with the invaders, then its funding ceases. Yeah. We don't want that to happen. Not really, to be honest. PWT defenses. Pulse wave torpedoes provide the most effective defense against alien attacks. These missiles have super dense warheads which can penetrate all known armor. The magnetic waves they produce disable electronic defenses. Nice. So, yeah. Alien implanter. So not only do they penetrate defenses. Yeah, we have excellent. So yeah, we... we oof. We didn't actually lose anything from that. Um, where we didn't actually bother to take out the... Or do the terror mission. We didn't lose anything. So that's quite cool. It's good to know. Destroy it. Should just knock this thing straight out. Yeah. Oh, we downed it. Okay. I was not expecting that. So we have our other sensor network there. Let's wait a little while. We really need to build our funding right back up. Triton 1. Go. Seriously need to build our funds up because that was such an expensive month. Lobster Man Squad Leader. Alien interdiction. The aliens have a policy of policing areas they are uh, interested in. Sending out a craft with the express purpose of securing an area before more intensive missions are begun. They will land at specified sites they intend to raid later to lock down the area and prepare the way for the next wave level of activity. Yeah. Okay. Alien Implanter. The alien implanter. This unit is used to fit aliens with molecular control implants, fertilize reproducing races, oof, and insert or remove organs and electronics from any creature. The process was thought to be done on subdued patients, but the subjects are very aware of the process, and unfortunately human anatomy seems to fit the unit perfectly. Yikes. That not good, brother. Come on, 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 come on. Bingo. Right. Ooh. Ouch and ouch and ouch. So. Now, throw. I don't understand this mind control. Throw. Does that have to be in the other hand? Can these guys not be mind controlled? Is that it? I mean, throwing it doesn't make any sense. Yeah, that just literally throws. can mind control Tazuths. Something has glitched somewhere. Something must 
have glitched somewhere. And here I was, I was really looking forward to this. Well, uh, okay, fair enough, I guess. That's really bloody annoying. <coughs> to be honest. Aim shot 88%. Oh, you can't see. Of course. Uh, oh, wow, you bloody hell, it hit. What the fuck? It hit twice! What is this? It's like the freaking Twilight Zone. You know shit's getting real when your um, tank hits something. 44. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Wowzers. This is... Interesting. Can we not like? Is there not like a uh, a button to push? Expend all remaining time units. Why would you do that? Oh well, I don't know. Forty-three. How many does it take to fire? Forty-eight. Right. Let's get you out there. Fifty-two. Oh. Oh man. Thirty-nine TUs left. Yeah. This is uh <clears throat> this is Fubar guys. This is utter Fubar. Not enough time units. Oh shit. Well, 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 34, 32, yep, he just, uh, just brushed that off. Well, this has gone horribly wrong, I think it's fair to say. And we don't know why. We can't use. Uh, mind control. Definitely going to look that up. Because 34, he's got 30. Can't shoot him. What? Look, just get out of the fucking way, mate. Eesh, eesh. Right. You can see three. What the? Alien pirate ship. Oh boy. Oh boy. Everything is fine. Everything is under control. I think. We're going to get slaughtered next turn. We're going to get up. Absolutely slaughtered next time. Uh. Mhm. Mm Unless you can get a very lucky, cheeky shot. No line of fire. Of course, there's no line of fire. 
Why would that be a line of fire? It's not as if our lives depended on it or anything silly like that. Ah. Oh, Jesus. Seriously? What is this? Oh, I don't know how we survived that, guys. <sighs> I was literally panicking pretty badly there. Somehow, we survived. And it looks like we might even get some Zerbite out of this. We downed this thing, but somehow, nope, there is explosions inside. There is explosions inside. I was going to say, maybe... Oh, you've only got the crap armor. Oh, gutted, my dude. Alright, let's get you out of the way. Let's get you up. And could you please... 37? No, you can't. Because you suck. What, 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 what was that? I don't know. I don't know what that was. Aim shot. Oh boy. 71%. I'll take it. I think that's somewhere in the region of the best we're going to get. Uh, let's disperse. Because I feel an alien grenade coming on. Thirty-three, thirty-one. Come on, you need to die. Thank you. Uh, who hasn't moved? Who hasn't moved? You. You want to have a little look around, buddy? Do I stick your little head out? See what you can see? Uh, uh. Okay. Well, I really didn't want to waste that shot, but I think actually in retrospect, it was worth it. Oh, come on. Seriously. And how are you not panicking yet? Nice try. Good effort. Does anyone have any grenades? Not that I really want to blow this stuff up. 45%. That's almost a guaranteed miss. Yeah. Yeah. You fired. Who can still shoot? Well, I mean, pretty much anyone over here can. 45, 44. Oof. That was a nice hit. Okay, you get points for that. I shouldn't be handing out points for that, but you get points for that. You're not going to be able to do shit, I don't think. Nope. 
Everybody that can has. Except maybe you. And you're going to be useless, but no line of fire, of course. Oh, he's panicked. That's fine. You're allowed to panic, buddy. We all have days like that. We really do. Oh, good man. But wait. There's more, apparently. Ooh. Was not expecting more. Definitely not expecting more. But then there was quite the party over here. How did that feel, H? How did that feel? Felt alright. You sure, mate? Felt like his brain is rattling around in his skull. 45. Thanks. <clears throat> this is why we pay you guys the big bucks, I guess. That was a good hit. Nice. Yep, we didn't get a lot from there. So much for that. That was quite pitiful, actually. That was really pitiful. We didn't even get um, any Zerbite, which I was really hoping for. Still, we might get some sellables. Small, very deep. Um, go get it. Going to be intercepted there. Nah, you're going to get away. No, you're not. Bring it down. Nice. Well, I guess we know what we're doing when we come back, guys. I guess. We're going to be taking down the small. And I'm going to have a look off camera and find out why our MC's not working. Because I have no clue, basically. Uh, we don't need that. Don't need those. Don't really need those, to be honest. Get rid of the corpses. Ooh, we're making a good bit of coin here, actually. Not bad. Iron armor. Oh, we've got a magnetic iron armor. Get rid of the plastic crap. Sell for a cool three million. Cool. Right, yeah, uh, I don't know why the molecular control's not working. I, I have no idea. Hmm, I'm going to go look that up. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, till next time.